Welcome back, travelers. Today, we will discuss some important updates regarding the performance details of Clarinda and Arlecchino. Let's start with Arlecchino. She is rumored to be a 5-star pyro attacker, a fact that has been known for a while. However, she is considered an overload attacker, which means she synergizes exceptionally well with Chevreuse. This synergy suggests the possibility of obtaining Chevreuse for free in version 4.6 to complement Arlecchino. Obviously, Overload comes with a significant knockback issue, so Arlecchino will likely solve this problem by either reducing the knockback range or grouping enemies together. She has been compared to Nouvellet in terms of her power and ease of play. So, when will she be released? According to initial information, her banner is expected to be in version 4.6. Overall, she looks to be quite strong. Choosing between her and Farina might be challenging, as the revival of regional gods is the usual pattern. Having discussed Arlecchino, let's move on to Clarinda. Clarinda, as seen in many in-game cutscenes, is a 5-star electro sword wielder. She is also said to belong to the overload niche, which is quite intriguing. The developers are gradually increasing the number of characters suitable for this reaction. Despite this, Clarinda is expected to be somewhat flexible, potentially acting as an off-field electro applicator, similar to Yamiko. Clarinda is believed to provide not just buffs or support, but also to act in a capacity similar to Feruzen for the team. If she is a 5-star, the extent of her buffs could be quite overwhelming. I believe Clarinda will be an excellent off-field support, but I hope she becomes an attacker because that's exactly how she appears. She is planned to be implemented in version 4.7, but keep in mind that everything could change as this is preliminary information. Personally, I am most looking forward to these two characters. What about you? Do you plan to pull for them? Please let me know in the comments and subscribe to the channel for the latest updates.